flow. Okay, let me go to my redeems page. We're here. Okay, well, I've loaded the page. We have this one from last time. Two days ago, actually. <laughs> Alright, uh, welcome. Welcome, Riz. Welcome, Duck. Welcome, Slime Molder. Also, welcome, Stream Elements. Uh, we're back here today. We are back at Iron Keep. Also, wait, why? Why is the fish. <laughs> How long does that fish last? No, it's gonna be there. Okay, so we were here. Last time, Zoli as well. Welcome. Uh, we killed a bunch of enemies. I think the guy on the bridge stopped spawning. I think these guys stopped spawning. Yeah, we died so many times that they stopped spawning. I think you can pick this thing up if you walk close enough. Oh, uh, you can just do- you could just do that. Oh, you also take a lot of damage. Okay, we're going here. It's mod appreciation day, is it really? Is it- if I go to the end stream, is it gonna say mod appreciation? No, that's a spoiler. We don't know. We don't know what today could be. It could literally be anything. But what if it's listed on nationaltoday.com? I have mods. Stream element. Sorry, stream elements, plural. It's there. Did I say welcome, Cole? I think I did. Anyway, that, that's cool. Um, so we're here today. Hopefully, we can make some good progress. And that is Dark Souls 2. You know how it is. Did this guy stop spawning? This guy, also this guy stopped spawning. Okay, we've died here so many times that so many of these enemies stopped spawning. This guy's still spawning though. Archer guy, definitely still spawning. This guy's still here. We got, uh, last time we were trying to summon Lucatiel to fight the boss because she has a quest where you defeat three bosses with her, still alive. And then you get her item set. So we're gonna try to do that. Hopefully, oh frick. Hopefully it goes well. Remember last time we fought the covetous demon and then we, we encountered some kind of glitch. The demon attacked us and then we, uh, we flew up into the sky. That was pretty cool. That was actually really cool. And then there was this time, there was a guy on the bridge, he attacked me, and then I attacked him, and then he started spinning. He did like a 360. Can you check the clips on this channel? They're there. Who's shooting at me? This guy? You? How dare you? How dare this guy shoot at me? We got this guy as well. heal. You have to heal. And then once I cross the bridge, there's like two other guys. There's like this guy right here. There's another guy. There's that guy over there. There's that, yeah, there's this guy. This guy. Don't think I forgot. And then there's another guy. They put so many guys here. Can't even believe. Oh, frick. <laughs> oh. There goes my souls. There goes my souls that were in the boss room, I think. Love to die from uh, falling into lava. I think I, I would not recommend it. That's like, that's one of the many ways you can die. Recently on YouTube, I've been recommended a lot of videos that are titled Thank You Dark Souls. It has a bunch of people dying in weird ways. Weird glitches weird stuff happening and uh you watch those those are pretty short they're pretty funny sometimes be like look at this guy this guy died in this weird way so funny definitely thanks to dark souls also it's kind of funny the way these guys run towards you i feel like they could they could be using larger steps Wait, this guy you see this guy Look at the way he runs at me. Once he crosses this area. Whoops. Okay, maybe not this time. And I think I also realize why sometimes I do more damage. Um, I think there's something called a counter attack bonus. Where if someone is in the middle of their attacking animation and you attack them, you do more damage. So that time that guy wasn't attacking. 
So I was doing less damage. No oh, frick. <laughs> okay, well there goes my 5,000 souls. That's pretty cool. I love this area. One of the best areas in this game. One of the goats. One of the goaded goats. Didn't even make it to the boss. Dying trying to demonstrate a mechanic. Yeah, look at the guy running at me. This guy doesn't even know. He doesn't even know how to run. But I'm sure like within the course of this hour, I'm going to keep dying to these enemies, but we'll have killed enough of them that they stop spawning. That guy, that guy on the bridge, most annoying guy. This guy, also kind of annoying. I'm sure like soon he'll stop spawning. There you, there you go. Also welcome to Enflow. It's gonna be that guy over there. Yep, this guy. I knew it. This guy's always here. You can always count on this guy. Try to use your camera targeting. And then it just spins around. It just does a spin. Does Dark Souls have self-adjusting difficulty? It does not. Why is everyone de- Oh, what the- where did this guy come from? <laughs> Why is everyone despawning? Because if you kill them enough times, they stop spawning. This is only a system in Dark Souls 2. I think it's because they added way too many enemies to the game. And it's like really annoying. I can see why people think this is one of the worst areas in the game. It also doesn't make sense. Why is there lava up here? We took an elevator. Suddenly we're like in a volcano. It makes no sense. You mean to tell me this volcano is like floating? Like in the sky for no reason? Speaking of floating in the sky, do you guys see the Breath of the Wild? Sorry, uh, the, what is it called? Tears of the Kingdom? They got floating islands. They got, uh... You can make custom weird physics things. I probably will not buy the game, but it seems cool. It's very cool. You can also clip through the ceilings, but it's an intended game mechanic. Okay, we target the target. The, oh, we got two guys. Oh no, now there's three guys. What the frick? Okay, get me out. Get me out of here. Get me the heck out of here. No, come on. There's so many people. You put too many people. Anyway, in the in the Tears of the Kingdom most recent thing, they had a thing where uh where Link was building a boat. He built a boat. And then he put wind generators on the boat. And the boat was zooming over the lake. It was pretty cool. Pretty cool to see what, what things people could make. But I would not play the game because I played I played um, Breath of the Wild, and it's it was very long. And wait, okay, I have this many souls. Maybe I should just um, go back and level up. These guys give quite a bit of souls. Okay, that guy stopped spawning. That guy over there stopped spawning. This guy still spawning. This guy is still spawning. Would I ever play A Link to the Past or something along those lines? I would probably play um, Oracle of Ages or Seasons. That's pretty cool. Maybe Link's Awakening at some point. I know Link's Awakening is available now on the Nintendo Switch Game Boy official emulator. But um, maybe, I don't know. Oop. Played those quite a bit as a kid. In fact, uh, Link's Awakening was the first Zelda game I played <laughs> as a kid. I d oh, look at that guy. That guy fell off. It was the first, it was the first Zelda game I played. I used to think Link's name was Zelda. Yeah, so when I played Link's Awakening, I named him Zelda. And apparently there's something special that happens in the game if you name yourself Zelda. <laughs> the heck, who's shooting at me? Oh, there's a guy right here. I forgot what it was. And 
that. Also, I, since I didn't know his name was Zelda, or I didn't know his name was Link, I used to think that, uh... That they named it Link's Awakening because the Game Boy had a Link Cable. And I thought this was like, it was a reference to when they invented the Link Cable. It's like, oh yeah, they awoken, they have awakened the Link Cable. I don't think you could actually use the Link Cable in that game. There was no Link Cable functionality. Anyway, you might be like, oh, you just killed the enemies. Why aren't you fighting the boss? Uh, because I'll probably lose these souls. So I'm going to go back and level up. Yeah. I played Link's Awakening. I failed so much at the Crane minigame. Oh, yeah, I forgot that was a thing. That game was fun. It's Link's Awakening DX even. It had like an extra color dungeon in the game because it was like on Game Boy Color. And they had they had Sans Undertale in there. If you play the game, you can see Sans Undertale. Well, I think I should start leveling up Vitality. Because I, I read that actually um, your equip load, the lower it is, like percentage wise, the faster your stamina recovers. So I might want to have some more, especially if I plan on like dual wielding great swords. I will definitely need much more equip load. I guess I should start leveling that. Well, but if I okay, if I level strength, no, because when I attack these enemies, they're like one hit away from dying most of the time. So I guess these two levels in strength might be enough to kill them all the time. Find out. We'll we'll find out. But they they're probably gonna stop spawning. They'll totally just be gone, and I'll be like, thank god. What's that? Summon sign? Wait, what's that doing? Oh, is this- if I want to PvP with someone, I can just fight this guy? <laughs> nah, no thanks. Anyway, Oracle of Seasons and Ages, pretty cool. Never seen that spell. What spell? Oh, me? The Wolfy spell, Welcome Marcel Waffle. It does nothing. It's just there. It's there for fun. For fun. Okay, I wonder if this guy stops wanting. Or did this guy. <laughs> okay, that guy stops wanting. This guy's still here, though. Okay, that was enough strength to kill them with one hit. That's good. A spell about nothing. Yeah, Seinfeld. It is Seinfeld. Okay. Oh, frick. Where did the <laughs> where did this guy come from? Wait, what? There's more guys. What are they doing here? How did they get here? You're telling me they ran over from over? Oh, frick. From over there. Oh, I have no. I have no HP. I can't target him. Rip me. Okay, so there's more guys that I've not killed. Anyway, as a spell about nothing, there is that, uh... The AI-generated Seinfeld Twitch channel, which is no longer based on Seinfeld. I noticed the viewership on that channel has dropped significantly. But a lot more people are watching AI generated SpongeBob. I see that one. AI generated SpongeBob. They have the voices and everything. They're AI generating SpongeBob. Got Patrick. Got other ones. And they take topic suggestions from chat. Which sometimes makes it a bit more interesting. Because, like, when I watch the AI generated Seinfeld thing, it's like, I don't know what they're. <laughs> it's not that interesting. I think the fact that it was based on Seinfeld was what made it interesting, but once they stopped the relation to Seinfeld, it just became like some generic thing. No one cared about it. But Spongebob? Everyone loves Spongebob. It's nothing to do with Spongebob except you have the voices. No, but they got a... Uh, sometimes they talk. They talk about the other characters. Uh, hey Spongebob, did you see blah blah blah? Squidward is, Squidward is there. What's happening? Where's everyone? Okay, there they are. 
that was not enough to kill them. No, wait, Mr. Krabs is there? I have not seen Mr. Krabs or Sandy. I've only seen Spongebob, Patrick, and Squidward. I think they also added like random chat members can show up in the background. That's kind of cool. Like, you can see that and be like, yo, that's me. It's literally me for real. When chatters see themselves on the stream. My issue with AI generated Seinfeld was that they didn't speak like they were actually in the show. Yeah, it was just like, it was characters that sort of resembled uh, Seinfeld characters. But besides that, there, was, there wasn't really anything else. Welcome, Tieto. Welcome. How do I get out of here? <laughs> do I have to go down? I have to go down here, perhaps. Have I pulled this? I have pulled this. You gotta go through the lava room. Okay, what is... I guess, I guess we can go fight the boss. And go up this way. It's fun. There's like a bunch of other AI generated channels nowadays. The future of comedy is completely just AI generated Twitch channels. You got Neurosama, you got AI generated SpongeBob. There's one that's like anime themed as well. What the heck? I tuned in for a few seconds, I didn't think it was that interesting. We got this guy. Someone else just died. This guy here, still alive. Oh, he's also an archer. I hate how everyone here is an archer. I'm gonna heal. Oh, there's another guy. Frick. Can't believe this. Can't believe they would do this to me. This guy here on the bridge. Not this time. Not this time. I don't want to fall off. Come on, <laughs> why, are you, why are you like this? Maybe if tech advances, it will be able to do more than short conversations. Who even knows? It could be so advanced, we will never find out. Anyway, I'm gonna use a... I'm gonna summon Lucatil to do her quest. I probably could just go back and level up the souls that I have. I don't even know why I care about her quest. It's just because like one stream some guy said, oh you know, Lucatil has a quest. I said, oh that's cool. I guess I'm doing it now. <laughs> I don't even know if her, if her equipment is that good. I did read that it has good stats for the weight requirements. Um, I don't know. Issue is that she needs to survive. Sometimes when you summon NPCs, they just die really fast. Oop. Oh no. What if this is the run? This could be the run. This could totally be the run. What's he doing? What else do you need besides cool looking equipment? A cool sword. I guess swords are equipment too. Oh frick, I forgot he did that. Forgot that he does that fire thing. He does three swings. He does a triple. He does that thing. What's he doing? What's he doing? Get away from there, Lucatil. We don't know what he's doing. He's got a fire sword. Okay. I could have I could have attacked there. <laughs> that was fire damage. Oh frick. Again, I forgot that he did that. Lucatil, you better not die. I'm doing your quest. You can't you can't die from this. Okay, but I'll die. Okay. Turns out I died before Lucatil died. What if Lucatil killed the boss right after I died? Does that count? 
can't believe I was worried about the boss dying and then I died. So embarrassing. This wolfy guy doesn't even know what he's doing. What the heck is he even doing? What if I'm AI generated? What if we trained a bot, trained an AI to, to listen to thousands of hours of me streaming? And then, uh, and then most of its dialogue comes from the pick cross screens where I'm just saying numbers. So like every few seconds I'll just say we got a 4 here, we got the 1-1. One, one. Even when I'm not playing Picross, it could be engaging content. You could watch it and be like, well, it's like he's actually there. It's like the real Wolfie Wolfington. It's literally me for real. Alright, we got this guy. Remember this guy. This guy right here. Oh, that was cool. Oh no, I forgot. I forgot about this guy. Okay, get me out. Get me out of here. Do not shoot me with your arrow, please. I need to to run in here and heal. I need to, okay, here we go. Here we go. All right, we got this guy. We got the, the another guy. Right. The other guy doesn't follow me. He's not even here. Okay, so easy, this guy. Easiest enemy you've ever seen. Nope. Okay, we'll try this again. We'll summon Lucatiel a second time. I think this is the fourth time we summoned. Here's it again. Um, it also doesn't heal you. Go, here's the phantom. Let's look at heal. Do I want to use a flask for that? No, I'll just use a life gem. All right, let's go. It's, it's, it's go time. It is going time. This could be the run. I'm gonna go get my souls though. It's a lot of souls. There's so many souls. Oh, oh shoot. I'm gonna, I'm gonna start doing some jump attacks. Jump attacks, they're pretty good. They're pretty great. I don't know what that attack is. Oh, I'm gonna heal. Gonna make sure you stay full on HP. Oh shoot, oh shoot. I almost died. I'm almost dead. Okay, he's doing something. He's got a fire sword now. Welcome, Orfish. Yeah, it's a wolf in time. It do be wolf in time, though. Shoot, I was trying to do a jump attack. <laughs> okay, I keep forgetting that he does that. He does three swings. I do a jump attack. No, just tank, just tank the boss for me. Keep, I keep failing to do the jump attack. <laughs> okay, Luca Teal, you're doing well. He does the blast, of course. Forgot. Totally forgot that he does it. I keep forgetting that he does it. I'm gonna go through this again. Can you believe? This guy keeps dying, even though he has a summon to help him. Is it like in um in in Souls games when you summon the the boss has more HP, right? If I was fighting this guy solo, he would have significantly less health. Also, welcome Lakeith. 
Yes. True. So true. Then you also get fewer souls. Summoning a boss, or summoning an NPC makes you have, uh, the boss gives you 25% fewer souls. So I'm sacrificing many souls to do this quest. Oops. Okay, get this guy, get that guy. Oh no, oh no, shoot. Oh frick, there's a guy from the back too. Hate this. Hate these guys. Did I notice how it got to? Yeah, it's, I keep talking about it. We take the elevator, and then we're in a we're in a lava zone. Everyone talks about this. I don't know how the world works. Like when I was watching Dark Souls One videos, they're like, "Here's the world design of Dark Souls One." We got interconnected levels. We got cool. You, you can see places from other places. This one is just like, I don't know, they just put different areas together. I mean, they look nice though, like, if you look at each level on its own, they're like pretty nice. But they don't connect well. The transition between them is very jarring. Oops. It's quite weird. Dang it. Okay, I knew I knew this guy would be here. I forgot about this guy though. <laughs> okay, okay. I'm gonna heal. I'm gonna heal. Don't rush me, I'm healing. Okay, there you go. It is quite the meme. Dark Souls 3 is kind of like this too. I don't know, I heard Dark Souls 3 was like pretty, like, decently liked, right? Definitely, definitely not like this. Don't shoot me, don't shoot me. What, how is he not stunned by that? I used a great sword. This sword was great. You didn't understand how great the sword was. Oh, come on. He was holding onto the arrow for this long. Okay. I used up many flasks to get here. I don't know if this is enough to fight the boss with. I can go back and level up. Um, do I want to do that? Yeah, whatever. <laughs> Let's go fight the boss. I'm summon Lucatil again. At some point, I'm gonna give up on doing this quest. I'm gonna run out of human effigies at some point. I know I have 20 or 19, but... You know, what if I keep dying? What if I just die constantly? Okay, here we go. This time, this is the run. Welcome, Genie81. This is really keeping your iron? Yeah. They keep so much iron in here. Lucatil is pretty cool. One of the goats of all time. Is Wolf short for what if? No, it's not short for anything. Oh, frick. <laughs> I keep forgetting. I keep forgetting he does this. I should. I should use a life gem. My attacks are all missing. Oh, what's he gonna do? What's he doing now? What is that attack? Gonna do, he's gonna do a jump, right? He does a jump. Okay, he jumps backward. Does he do the explosion attack? He's gonna do the he's gonna do the explosion, look out. Look out, Luca Teal. He's gonna jump. He's doing the jump. He's doing that fire thing.
Yeah, he's got a fire sword. He's gonna do two hits. He's gonna jump. Never mind, he doesn't jump. Sometimes he jumps. Sometimes he doesn't. He's gonna do the he's gonna do the thing, right? He does not do the thing. Oh frick. What the <laughs> what the heck? What was that? Yeah, that was pretty bad. I only ask because one of your catchphrases is what if. I do say that a lot, huh? In uh, Picross, I go like, what if this thing was here? Assuming the five was here, this tells you that two's gotta be here. So welcome props, not Jack. Yeah, two hit. I'm not wearing very many, <laughs> very much armor. You take more damage if you're running, right? If you're doing an attack animation or you're running, you take damage. Take additional damage. Okay, th thankfully this guy on the bridge stopped spawning. So that's something. Uh, welcome Lord Corsera. This guy's still here though. Okay, the guys that come from over here, they stop spawning. No, oh, they're still here. That guy's still there. <laughs> At some point, he'll oh, this guy as well. There's three guys here. At some point, you will stop spawning. You right here, you will stop spawning. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna heal. I'm gonna heal. Okay, I'm just gonna die to this. Rim. <laughs> Guess I'll just die to this guy. That's cool. It's also cool. Why is their aggro range like so huge? I feel like every enemy in this game, they aggro you from like all the way across the map. This base is a great way to learn parries. Nah. <laughs> nah. Probably, you're probably meant to do it. But what if I don't feel like it? That's a parry. That's a parry right there. Is this a parry? Is that an attack? I met the clown. I have not. There's a clown here. I know you can buy the clown armor. Somewhere. This my, have I finally kept the iron? <laughs> oh, the merchant is the jester? Okay, yes. I have met... I have met them. That is a parry, okay. I mean, it is a pretty great sword, though. That sword, pretty great. Come on, man. <laughs> Stop. Stop. Why would he do this? Why would he do this to me? Alright, you fight this guy. Okay, this guy's still here. Oh, I knew it. Okay. At some point, you guys will be done. And then I'll be like, remember when these guys used to spawn? Remember when these enemies used to spawn? Why would he put away his sword? You would think if you were fighting someone, you'd keep your sword out. Jester armor has ridiculously strong abilities. I think um, I think I read that one of the things is that it, it increases item discovery or something. Is that true? Okay, this gotta be the run. It, ha it has to be. It's gotta be. There's no way that I could lose this time. Yeah, they got the motion blur. How are they so blurry? Okay, this is it. Prevents backsteps and fall it. Wait, what the frick? Oh, there's an archer right there. How did they see me from all the way there? Okay, I am running out of life gems though. Okay, this is it. This is it. Here we go. Are my souls in here? No, I died before I got to this room. Ow. 
Okay, sometimes he does the explosion and sometimes he doesn't. What's up with that? Why does he sometimes do it and sometimes not? Boots prevent fall damage, torso prevent backstabs, headpiece boost discovery. Oh, I see. Is it like the, the cat ring? The cat ring is one of those things. Okay. <laughs> one of those things that also decreases fall damage. I gotta figure out how to do can stack. Need a way to be more consistent with my jump attacks. Sometimes I try to do it and then it just doesn't work. Oh frick. I didn't know he did that. Is he gonna do it? Yeah, he does. No, he doesn't do it this time. He's powered. Yo, he's just like Artorius. What the? <laughs> See, I, I can never tell when he's gonna do the explosion. Is it just like you should always run away from him when he's doing that? He's too strong. Kills me in one hit. He stabs the ground for too long. I guess I should just always stay away from him. I'm sure there's some sort of way you can tell whether he's doing that attack, right? Gotta be some sort some sort of visual cue. Like uh, when I was fighting Manus in my Soul Level One run, there's these two attacks that he does, and sometimes he at he attacks like twice in a row. Sometimes he attacks only once, and it's hard to tell. But then I learned if you look at his face, sometimes when he opens his mouth, it depends on like when he's opening his mouth. If he opens his mouth late, he's gonna do the two hits. If he doesn't, he does the one hit. It's like a really subtle thing. But I learned there's got to be some way that this guy does it as well. Oh, this guy's fast. Oh, frick. <laughs> uh, my attack animation was uh, stopped. Okay, get, get me out of here. Get me out of here. This guy's going to shoot at me. Get behind the wall. Okay, we'll heal twice. Ah, oh, come on, <laughs> really? Dude, I was healing. This is like one of the most annoying guys. This guy, one of the worst guys out there. That guy over there also sucks. Okay, this time though. This time, this gotta be, this has to be the run. There's no way this is not the one. Jester gloves give you more souls. The dark souls. One of the worst. One of the worst of all time. The woat. The worst of all time. The woat of all time. Alright, Lucatiel. Here we go. Get my souls. Gotta pick up my souls on the floor. You guys ever just drop your souls on the floor in real life? Literally me. Every day. As we speak, I'm dropping my souls. He's gonna do the... I knew it. I saw it. I saw he was gonna do it. I tried to do the jump attack. I failed. Only during all the noise. Like all the time, perhaps. No. See, I definitely pressed the uh, both attack buttons at the same time. And yet he doesn't do the jump attack. Here, I'll use the life gem. Got the flame sword now. He's the flame swordsman. 
It's the guy with the flaming sword. Welcome, Albos Jones. Yeah, we're in. We're fighting Bowser as we speak. Bowser from the Super Mario movie. Here he is. He's gonna do the explosion. Okay, he does not do the explosion. Sometimes he does it. This time he did not do it. Ow. Oh frick. <laughs> This is just the mid button. This isn't Bowser. Man, Lucatio is a lot tankier than I thought. Oh man, really? <laughs> oh, yeah, that was pretty close though. Doug Bowser. The real when is the Bowser movie <laughs> sorry, the Mario movie coming out? Is it this month? They released their final trailer. I saw it on YouTube. That's pretty cool. Okay. This one. Th this one is the run. This one is definitely the run. See, we're running right now. If this is not the run, what could it even be? The walk. In April? Okay. But they're gonna show it in theaters only, right? For until they release it on uh, streaming platforms. I will not go to the theaters to see it. There's no movie that I want to go to the theaters for. Come on! <laughs> Jeez, oh my god. Oh, there goes my souls. I hate this guy. These two guys, they're uh, awful. These guys suck. If I was them, I would simply do something else. Imagine working here though. It's like, it's so hot. We got lava everywhere. It's probably not OSHA compliant. You know, you go have lunch, someone could easily push you into the lava. In fact, you can see it here sometimes. Sometimes I'm just walking. The enemies, they just fall into the lava. This is no place to work. And you're wearing armor all the time? It's gotta be so hot. I someone to record it on their flip phone. No, people got regular phones. Okay, these guys are still spawning. <laughs> these guys are still here. Don't you shoot your arrows at me, man. 2023 and you're still shooting arrows? What the heck? <laughs> yes, coward strats. You, you, sir, are a coward. You should use your sword. Like me, for real. It's me using a sword. Slightly more hospitable than Phoenix. You think Phoenix would be would be really hot because it's named after like a bird, the bird that's constantly on fire. Armor school, it is pretty cool. And we got Luca Teal. Some of my last life gems. I forgot that guy was in my line of sight. This guy, if he saw me, he could have been shooting at me. <laughs> Yeah, but he didn't. Okay, here we go. This is it. This... Definitely the one. This time I'm not gonna do the jump attack. I wasted so many attack cycles trying to do a jump attack and missing the input somehow. He's gonna do the explosion, I knew it. I'm just going to do the regular attack. I'm going to do the regular hit. I'm losing HP by being near him. I'm going to heal. He's going to do the explosion. Okay, 
do one hit and get out of there. Sometimes he does three hits, not this time. Now he's got a fire sword. This guy's got a sword made of fire. So do two hits, he's gonna jump. He's gonna do the explosion. No, he doesn't do the explosion. No, I said I wasn't gonna do the jump attack, but I did. It doesn't even teach you to do them. Well, I don't think the first game taught you to do them either, right? It's not like Elden Ring where <laughs> where every attack, where where a jump attack is the most strong attack in Elden Ring. He's gonna do the explosion. No, he's not doing the explosion. There. Oh frick. <laughs> oh man. Not again. I thought this was the run. This was not the run. What if I just fought him without Lucatil? No, but I gotta do the quest. I gotta do the quest. Welcome, Shevs. What if I don't do the quest? What if I don't get the cool equipment? Lucatil's armor. I should probably go back and buy life gems. I only got three left. They're pretty cheap, right? It's like 300 for one. With all the souls that I've lost uh, <laughs> running back to the boss, I probably... I feel like I probably got like 100,000 souls. Just fighting these enemies over and over again. Getting this guy still spawning. This guy's still here. You should do it because it's sad. Lucatil's quest is sad. I would simply look at that. That was awful aim. I wasn't even moving, and this guy missed. This guy could not. E okay, never mind. <laughs> never mind. He did not miss that time. I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna buy. No, I could. I could wait until next time. I'm gonna use my. <laughs> I'm gonna use my remaining life gems. I'm gonna use another effigy. I guess I don't have to. I don't have to summon Lucatil on these bosses specifically, right? I could always go back to um. Use a bonfire ascetic at the uh, that one place. No Man's Wharf. That would probably be much easier. And then I could probably pick up a second Greatsword from that. If I met Pate at Earthen Peak. I did. Well, I saw him once, and he said there's treasure ahead, and then I went. I thought it was going to be a trap, but nothing happened. I think maybe I was supposed to go back and talk to him. Is there something else from that, or just... <laughs> oh. No, my stamina... Yo, the real Genie A1. The real Chevs 2. Is there a Genie A2, perhaps? Don't remember if you had to talk to him again. I guess I could go back. Does it matter? Is his quest good? Is there a Chev's one? There probably there's gotta be a Chev's one. There's no way there isn't. I'm gonna use my <laughs> use a life gem. It's the same quest as Clayton. I remember that guy. Hey, Lucatil's about to die. I didn't realize you were already this low. <laughs> I didn't realize Lucatil was already this low on HP. 
I mean, I'm probably gonna die before Lucatiel does. No. Well, if Lucatiel dies, then there's no point in doing it. It's gonna. No. Okay, that <laughs> that explosion was so delayed. Lucas Hill is not surviving. There's no way. Lucas Hill, get out of there. You are not about to live. Okay. Okay, I, I regret my words. I drew the aggro. I saved Lucas Hill by taking the aggro. <laughs> I saved her life. Yeah, Shev's three. He, he, excuse me, Lucatiel, he. Oh wait, I should get, I should go back. <laughs> okay, this run I'm gonna go back buy some more uh, gift gems. S key is broken. Mile. He doesn't know. I don't know. We don't know. No one here even knows. Is this guy still spawning? This guy's still here. What about this guy? This guy? Also still here. Wolfowl. <laughs> Wolfowl. Okay, I'm gonna kill this guy. I'm gonna run back. I'm gonna go back to town. Actually, I should probably. I could, I could go pick up my. Uh, go in there. I could use a homeward bone. Pick up my, my lift gems. Or pick up my my souls and then. Just get out of there. Didn't play Dark Souls two because I'm not at school. What? Not a scholar. No, this is, we're not the scholar. You're not the scholar. Whoop. Oh shoot. <laughs> get me out get me out of here. See you. Got my souls. You could probably just save and quit, right? That's an that's another thing you could do. If you didn't want to use your your homework bone. Okay, I know you're doing a bit. You can you can type S now. We knew you said your S key is broken. You can't type that without pressing S. Everyone knows you're faking. Okay, we're gonna buy some life gems. Where is it? This one right here. Let's buy. How much do I want? How many do I want? Um, 21. 20, yeah, let's get 20. <clears throat> you know what? Let's just spend all of mine. <laughs> wait, that's not that. Wait, that's not all of them. How many did I buy that time? Did I not buy? Did I not spend all my money? <laughs> okay, here we go. We're going back. I'm gonna hydrate. It's it's about it's been about an hour. Alright, it's gotta be the run though. This has to be the run. Wouldn't it be funny if this was not the run? We got the egg. We got the egg on us. There's no way. I should probably take the, the homeward bone off of my inventory. So I don't accidentally use it.
Or unequip the X button. X button is this one. Yes, it is that one. You would. He would lamau. Okay, here we go. This guy, at some point, he's gonna stop spawning. That archer guy right here. Nope, he's still there. This guy's also still here. Oh, that guy jumps. Okay, hold on. What the frick? That guy jumps down. What's that gold ring? I don't remember. What's happening? What are you doing? <laughs> Got a traffic jam. Get out, get out of here, you. you. Oh, frick. Oh, shoot. Uh... Okay, he got me. He tricked me. What's that gold ring I'm using? Um, It might be HP recovery. <laughs> might be the thing that heals you 1 HP every, like, 10 seconds. Now, everyone says it's bad, but I still use it. Yeah, <laughs> Ring of Restoration. I, you know, I should probably equip... Uh, ring of Steel Protection, maybe? Ring of... Ring of the the two ring of blades maybe. Welcome modern. Ring of blades. <clears throat> it does more damage. Loading. No, I'm uh, I'm in the inventory. In the spell slot. There it is. What what emote is that? That's uh. Angeli331, Angelic Loaf331. Smug. Looking so smug. Okay, we got the Ring of Blades. I heard the Ring of Blades is, uh, is much better if you have a fast attacking weapon. Because it stacks. It stacks on every hit. It doesn't stack, but it applies the same damage to every attack. And if you do many attacks, then it does better. Get way more mileage out of a defense ring. Okay, maybe I should do that. <laughs> yeah, I do, like, I have no armor. Oh wait, one of these guys stopped spawning. Oh, frick. Okay, that was stupid. <laughs> That's my fault. It's totally my fault. Who needs armor? Just don't get hit. I would simply not get hit. I guess I guess I will equip Ring of Blaze, we got the the stone ring, we got the got the <laughs> Do I even have the uh, HP oh, no this one Re reduces damage from falling Physical attack and This one I'll use this one Blame Miyazaki he didn't even work on this game you can't blame Miyazaki for a game he didn't work on. You could blame him for... Or Blight Town, though. You could blame him for... The Bed of Chaos. But you can't blame him for the railings in this game. The lack of railings here, he had nothing to do with this. He was innocent. He would have? I don't think he would. I feel like you're making this up. What? I was trying to pick up my souls. <laughs> there, there it is. Oh, that guy. Okay. That guy stopped spawning. That's cool. So the only guy left is this guy. <laughs> it's only this guy left. I've died here so many times. Now. <laughs> the poison swamp. I mean, there's a poison swamp in this game, too. Okay, we're gonna do... What? Use, uh, use Lucatiel one, one more time. This is gonna be the last time. We'll not need to summon Lucatiel again, because... He, because this will be the run. This will be the run where we win. <coughs> is the only Dark Souls game without a poison swamp? 
then what was uh, Earthen Peak? What was that one area? <laughs> what was that uh, that area that I was just in? Is that not a poison swamp? There was definitely poison. Not a swamp. Well, okay, a poisonous. No, there was a. There was like a swamp. There's like a swamp here. <laughs> Right next to the bonfire? Was that not a swamp? A mini swamp? Maybe not a swamp, just like a pool. <laughs> just a little pool. There's no poison. There was poison. You. Go back and check right now. Oh, he's powering up. He takes so much less damage when you do that. When he's doing that hit. When he's powering up, you can't even hit him. Do your, do your three hit. Do an explosion. He's gonna do an explosion. He's not doing the explosion. I meant to do the jump attack there. As usual, I missed the inputs. There's the explosion, I knew it. This could be the run. If I don't mess up here. This could be this could be it, perhaps. Oop. Welcome Chocojax. Get out, of, get out of there. As long as Lucatiel, Lucatiel, you better not die. Oh, we done it. it. Only took a billion attempts. All right, that's cool. I should go back. You know, I know. <laughs> It's probably a. Is there a bonfire up there? No, I'm gonna. I'm gonna go back. In case there is not a bonfire up there. No, they usually put a bonfire. Whatever. I'm gonna go back anyway. Just to be safe. There is a bonfire. Well, it's too. It's too late now. This game has betrayed my trust. I'm gonna go all the way back the long way. Back across this bridge. Now I can level up. I can level up many times. Oh yeah, I should go back and talk to Pate, right? Assuming he's still there. I forgot where he was. Strength level up. Buy the Jester armor if I want to enable easy mode. Maybe I should do that. Maybe, you know what? Okay, maybe. <laughs> oh, but I'm all the way here. Yeah, whatever. I wish I wish you didn't have to go back to town all the time, just to level up. Why can't that lady just spawn right next to the bonfire? You know why can't she be like Elden Ring? Why can't this be like the first game? Yeah, Pate? More like... Pate. Do I want some Elder Sword? I do not. I'm gonna- I'm gonna use two Great Swords. Okay, purchase armor, right? The Jester set, perhaps. Should I just buy all this? Does it give you a bonus if you have all of them? Raises item discovery, nullifies crits, 14 dex requirement. I mean, okay, I guess I could level up dex because I need, if I'm going to be dual wielding um, two great swords, I'm going to need 15 dex anyway. So I guess, I guess I will do it. Might as well. Just her pants are useful. Level up dex. 
Ganflow, didn't you say that you would you power stance great swords? Doesn't that require you to level up Dex? <laughs> uh, no fine screen. I'm just gonna buy all of this. Why not? I'm gonna spend souls for no reason. Nine of them? No, <laughs> not nine of them. Okay. Cheers, bro. You guys remember that vine of the guy with the holding the cup? And he says, "Cheers, bro." And then it just go. His arm just goes really far. Classic, classic vine. Okay, we're gonna go back and level up. We're gonna put points into dexterity. Power stancing was also worthless since the increase of damage wasn't worth the cost of stamina. No, but it does so much damage. It's gonna do so much damage. I don't even understand. Alright. I'm gonna have 14 decks. Are we only- wait, we don't have- we don't have enough to level up. Okay, I guess we have 12. Strength time? No, it's too late. It's dex time. Guy's out here upgrading his dexterity, like some kind of some kind of dex user, perhaps. Power stance for damage is pretty disappointing. Look, but it looks cool. It looks cool though. It's probably not worth it, but it looks so cool. All right. Oh yeah, I was, I was gonna talk to Pate. <laughs> Alright. Where was Pate? Pate was back at here, right? Pate was here. I don't even remember. Power stands to get weird movesets like Lance on Yorg's, Yorg's spear. A Pate actor. I remember. Oh, I got him. <laughs> Let's go. Okay, where the heck was Pate? He down here. Was he down there? Me up here. Where's he at? No, he was over there, right? Was he in that room? He might. He might be through here. No, not here. <laughs> it's up here. Oh, frick, why did I do that? <laughs> I should have remembered. Oh man, these guys. I'm losing HP so fast. No! <laughs> it's near an area with fire witches. I mean, there's a lot of those. <clears throat> I could probably look it up. I could look up a video. Is it here? Is he this way? Look at this guy. This guy thinks he's so cool. I hate having to aim this weapon. <laughs> I'm about to die. Okay, never mind. Well, you see that? His sword just fell off. Not the sword, the claw? Whatever. I think he might have been here. Pete might have been this way. Yeah, this this is like over here. <clears throat> I think it was down here, right? Possibly. No, it was not over here. Okay, it turned out it was not here. Over here? Over here, perhaps? Did I come from this way? No, he was down here, right? There was- there. okay, there was this thing. What the heck? Yo, yeah, well, they're in sync! You guys remember the boy band and <laughs> sync? 
That's them. That's two of them. That's two of the NSYNC members. Um... It was not here. Guess where his treasure was? Okay, so it was below here. Where are the heads? Look, they were just born this way. Oh, hold on. He's here. There he is. Well, perhaps you're more. In any case, the treasure is... I what treasure? What treasure? I've been there. There's nothing there. There's nothing here. This? Was this his treasure? Was there supposed to be something dangerous here? Because I definitely remember going, th <laughs> going through this room being suspicious. Like, oh yeah, there's going to be a trap. And there wasn't. What's up with that? They're just a regular guy. Let that sink in. What the? Alright, well there's not the, I don't remember how to get back. It's not patches, but what about the first time? Oh shoot. I forgot about this guy. Can I make that jump? Didn't I ask this once? <laughs> how do we get to that side? Is it like a door? Uh, I guess I dropped down from no I don't. There's nothing there. Gave you a soapstone jump. Can I make this jump? It seems kind of far. It seems pretty far. I don't know about this. I leveled Dex. I leveled adaptability. <laughs> this is, good. is this? Okay, I'm gonna try it. Oh, frick. Did not expect that to work. Oh, shoot. <laughs> I got no stamina. I got no stamina. He's gonna kill me. This guy killed me. I, I didn't get the treasure. Wait, I could have just walked. Right? I could have just walked across that. <laughs> I don't know. Well. It's time to go back. I forgot how to get there. Yeah, it was to the right. <laughs> the reason the mannequins have no heads, it has to do with Naruto. Is that true? Is that real? What the? There's three of them? Are they ninjas? Is this the ninja clan? For real ninjas? So it was down here. It was down here. The original design was faceless mask Naruto suit. <laughs> Wait, really? What the? That's kind of weird. Can't believe Naruto copied copyrighted ninjas. They own the design to all ninjas. Okay, I remember. We came this way. What the? Uh, yeah, this guy. I forgot about this guy. Oh no, you can't just go. Okay. You can't just walk across. Alright, there you go. This better not be a mimic. Wouldn't it be funny if this was a mimic? Do chest and break if you attack him. That 
it's like, what the heck is that? Crimson water. Oh, I see. This is what that was. Is there a way out of here that doesn't involve jumping? No, we're good. We're good. Okay, we talked to Pate. Now we can go... We can go back. Go back to that area. We've been here. We don't want to be here. Is it down here? Is it this way? I'm just going to use a homeward bone. <laughs> I don't feel like figuring this out. Bowser. Jack Black. Okay. I think I have enough to, uh, to level up, right? Well, probably not enough to level up, but enough to be able to use a soul to level up. How many do I need? I need about 2,200. 2,300 souls-ish. There's a website that tells you how many of these things are worth. Okay, 2,200. Information, 2,000. Okay, we use a Soul of a Proud Knight. Soul of a Proud Knight. Okay, that is 2,000, right? That is... That is 2,000. And then I use a Large Soul of a Lost Undead. Large soul. That's 400. And that should be enough. Why not just pop all of them? What if I need them? What if I needed them? You know, I probably should. I probably should level them. <laughs> It'd be nice to have some stats. I do need them, do I? Now? Get this guy leveling up dexterity. You know what? Okay, fine. I will use him. And we'll use a... How much is it? Soul of a Brave Warrior? That's 5,000. I'm going to use all of these. I'm going to use so many of these. Wow, 1,500. 15,000 even. If you want cool greatswords, don't use the those. I'm probably not going to use these souls. I'm going to use these regular souls. Got 27,000. I'm gonna use all these. Might as well use all these. 6,000. Might as well use this one. Making boss weapons is easier. I never made- I've never made a boss weapon. <laughs> Not even in the first game. Okay. Level up decks to... 14. I'm gonna put, well, probably 15, right? 15 to, to two hand the thing. And then strength. What is it, like 40 something? Wow, we can only level up a few times. Let's level up, uh, <laughs> let's level up vitality. No, you know, no, strength. Or strength. No, vitality. We need to equip some armor. Let's, <laughs> let's add some vitality. I'll take one point off of Dex. That was not as many levels as I thought it would be. In the first game, it's a pain and most of them suck. But what about the uh, Smo's hammer, though? Okay, now we can become a clown. Can you believe this? We can now become a clown. Jester's camp. Wow, we got a lot of these leggings, huh? <laughs> the Jester. Got this one. We got a... Uh, Jester armor. This one. Jester's robes. Jester's gloves. Let's go. That's pretty cool. 
Yes, yeah, Mole the Clown. All right. Look, it is me, the clown. We're literally clowning around. Okay, now we can resume with the story. Remember when Ice Age came about, came out, and everyone was excited about Jester's Camp? What? That's the that's the movie with the the mammoth. That squirrel. That one squirrel. Remember that squirrel? The Ice Age squirrel. You ever seen that jester with like a <laughs> the sword like this? I would be afraid. He's running at you. This sword that's like the same size as he is. Okay. Welcome to Y Onion. Oh right, the pursuer shows up. <laughs> Forgot about this. I didn't even know. Oh, what the heck? No, I'm cursed. How could he do this to me? I'm about to die. I've never I've never beaten the <laughs> I've never defeated the pursuer like the way you're supposed to. Not this time either. Uh, if there's a bonfire past this room, though, I should probably just rush toward it and then come back here and fight him. Just so that I don't have to, like, wait. Don't have to run back the whole way. Magic? Oh, you were talking about Ice Age the movie? I don't, I don't know Magic the Gathering. Totally unfamiliar with the magic. I've never even gathered magic. Okay, I'm going to I'm gonna run. I'm gonna run past this guy. Get that bonfire, then come back here and fight him. Is it this way? It was this way. He's so bad at pursuing. Why did they call him the pursuer? He just like he just goes away. He doesn't pursue you at all. We did a chess here. <clears throat> Got a shield. He always comes back. Yeah, but like he doesn't. You can just run away. You can simply just run. Okay, now that we're here, we can go back and fight him. We can fight him a few times. That shield is that shield good? Ow. So reference to a YouTuber? What? Okay. <laughs> I don't know how to fight this guy. Nah, I don't I don't feel like fighting him. We can come back later. I would like to progress with the story. There's a contest for Oh wait, I think I I think I did see that. I saw that on a YouTube comment. Some guy made a video and he was like, uh something about Dark Souls 2, and then he said, This is my shield. This is the shield I designed. And I said, whoa, what the That's pretty cool. Too bad it was for this game, huh? If it was for like Dark Souls 1 <laughs> or 3. But now everyone's like, oh Dark Souls uh Dark Souls 2. Many people don't like this game. Okay, we can go across here. This contest for For one also? For one, two, welcome mechanized gentlemen. The force unit shield is allegedly based on the Marcus shield. It's found to be plagiarized? What the? Wait, what was the point of fighting that boss? The the point of fighting, uh... If there's just... This just goes the same way. I could've just skipped it. 
I could have just like gone up this ladder. Or does that does that unlock something else? It gets you a bonfire. That's it. I thought it was a required. Well, I guess it's not required then. <laughs> okay. It's incredibly grueling without unlocking that bonfire. I guess like the fact that I killed enemies enough times that they stop spawning makes it a bit less grueling. Right, he just ran away. This guy just ran away. What the heck? I would rather not fight this guy uh, <laughs> over here. The turtle guards with hammers and the lava. Oh, I see. That's why it's Bowser's Castle. I can't believe they copied Mario. Try luring it out, luring what out? Oh, this guy. <laughs> Don't you dare, should I not pull this? Lever ahead and then nice jump. I would like to, oh, there's a guy, <laughs> no. Hold on. Mario and Dark Souls. This, is this canonical to Dark Souls? To Mario? Yeah, that painting, like from Mario. <laughs> Literally, well, he just lowered that guy into the lava. And just killed that man. And for what? Got a lock stone. Is it worth using this one? Is it worth using this lockstone? I don't know. I think I will just. Oh, this this sucks. <laughs> it is worth it. Okay. It's a whole new area. It opens a PVP covenant area. Okay, I could come back. I don't. I don't need to do that. <laughs> I don't really care about PVP. But I guess it it is a new area though. Could always come back here. There's a lot more to it. Is it worth okay fine, I'll do it. <laughs> fine. I'll do it. This is why I have the backseating allowed, so people can tell me whether it's worth wasting an item on this thing. What is it? What is that? Oh, oh frick. Got a ladder. There's also a bonfire, but there was a bonfire right there. The bonfire, but it's a one way drop. It involves going through the PvP area every time. Oh, this. Oh, frick. Okay. No, we don't have to, like, keep coming back here. Right? If we want to just go to the other bonfire, we totally could. Alright, he looks so silly. <laughs> Look at this silly clown. Jumping through. The bell. Taco Bell? Wait, hold on. <laughs> I, I mashed through the dialogue too fast. Oh, the Bell Keeper Covenant. That's, uh, is that different from the, the, the whatever? The other one? Super rare red phantom in the Bell Tower that has lore? <clears throat> oh, we got a soul. Wow, okay. Cool gear. Also, good night, Zoli. Belt, what the frick? What is this? 
O Zé Grande. Mario reference? Bell Covenant is about invading the Bell Tower to get Trunks, Twinkling, Titanite, and Petrified Dragons. I do need some, uh, some Trunks to upgrade this equipment. This weapon. What's this? You can shoot. You can shoot. Not sure what the point of that was, but I'm sure that's a thing. You can get them from the skull. Yeah, eventually, huh? <laughs> Not yet. And also it costs some money. It costs significant amounts of money. Sadness ahead, <laughs> give it up. Armor but sadness? What could it be? Simpleton's Spice. Welcome to mine. Can't believe this scholar study studied the first sin. Yeah, what about the second sin? That's where the red phantom spawn. What did that bell do? I'm gonna go up. I'm climbing a ladder. That's where he, where he spawns, but he didn't. Why didn't he spawn? What the heck was that? Who is doing this at me? Why does he sometimes spawn? Why does he sometimes not spawn? What's that deal? Because I'm not human. Is it because he's too good? You think he thinks he's too good for me? What is Simpleton Spice? Gorgeous view. It's kind of nice. Is decently nice. All right. So we were. Oh, frick. <laughs> Spice for simple. It's uh the Spice Girls. You guys remember the Spice Girls? What the? As you reduce the int cost of sorceries by one, I will never use sorceries. So that item does no good for me. Okay, what's what do I do here? Oh, oh okay, it's, this is where I was. Now we're on the other side. They don't even know I'm here. They they're just walking around. Yo, was that the reference to the guys who throw fire at you in the first game? <clears throat> About fire throws, the people with the fire bombs. Did you bring back the spices? It was a nice mechanic. Yo, Dark Souls reference. There's a fake wall hidden door up ahead. Up here. Is this a mimic? <laughs> this looks like a mimic. <laughs> this feels like it's a mimic. I don't know. It's not. <laughs> they tricked me. What the heck? They tricked me. They made me think it was a minute. Immolation. It's on the right before I drop down into Iron Keep. Up ahead, meaning here. Is this up ahead? This is up ahead, right? Immolation sets you on fire. Okay. There's a hidden seat, this thing.
Hidden path ahead, therefore control required. Is it not? Is it here? Oh, right. I forgot. <laughs> why didn't? Why sometimes you gotta like attack them? Sometimes you gotta talk to them. Visions of tough enemy. Is that a mimic? Is this a mimic? That's not a mimic. This game you only talk to them? Okay, I guess the exception then is the uh, the Pharaoh's Lockstone things. Those you can attack. Sometimes you can roll through them as well. BKGS. What was that? I didn't even look at what item that was. Something Greatsword? What did I just get? Black Knight Greatsword? Is it good? Ah, oh, there it is. You need, uh, you need stats that I don't have. A Black Knight Sword. Okay. So that was it. Was that the whole area? Was there anything else back there? I can do invasion, I see. Um, I think I will go back and level up. Is that it? Was that the whole area? Okay, I guess I'm going back. I'm going back to that bonfire. Got the ability to set yourself on fire. Well, what if I don't want to do that? What if that? What if I'm above that? Oh shoot! Hold on. Hold on. I'm gonna go back to town to level up. Which way was it? It was over here. It was over here. Go back to Majula. A streamer is not metal. I would I would not set myself on fire. I would not advise doing this. Didn't you learn from the first game? The first game, spoilers, the ending of the first game, you set yourself on fire and it just ends. What if I don't want that? <laughs> Welcome, good cat, good cat gaming. Jula. Okay, let's level up strength. We're back on the strength grind. Okay. So now... Wait, not there. I want to go to this one. Never play Jump King? I did play Jump King. If you check my uh, my VODs, I have played Jump King. I've not beaten it though. <laughs> I have no plans on playing it ever again, but I did play it. It's basically just a Zatsudan game. Have I been donating your friendly neighbor donating to your friendly neighborhood armor merchant? I have not. What does he do? What's this guy? What is this guy doing? Can you please come out here? Sal armor. But what is what does that do? It just gives you souls. What the? Oh frick! I'm gonna I'm gonna run. <laughs> Got to heal. More arm. The more you buy from him, the more stuff he sells. Is anything is anything good though? Do you have anything that's worth it? I'm gonna send that guy into the lava. Boss armor. But what about the clown set? This clown set is pretty cool. 
He sells incredible armor? Okay, maybe I should. What if I want to be a clown for the whole game? <laughs> okay, it's pretty cool, right? Look at this clown. We can be a clown. Ow. Oop. Highest defense stuff in the game? What if, what if I get Lucatiel's armor, though? What if I complete Lucatiel's quest? Then, then what's the point of even doing it? Lucatiel's armor was pretty good. Welcome, Nano Dan. Yeah, we're a clown. Out here, clowning around. Clown suit has little defense and no points, <laughs> yeah, but it looks cool. Oh shoot! This area kind of sucks. But kind of, I mean, like extremely. This area is extremely sucks. But you're still doing lunge attacks with a giant weapon. All that one hit damage. It's nice. It's a nice mechanic. The ladder. The ladder. Oh wait, wait, how did this- did I not kill this guy? <laughs> Where did he come from? Wait, hold on, ladder? Is there a ladder around here? Oh, right here. He walked through- okay, <laughs> that's why he was almost dead. Okay. I'm gonna use the life gem. Oh, shoot. Jump scare? They love to jump scare you in this game. Nice life gem count. Yeah, 42. That's the, that's the funny number. It's the cool number. Sadness ahead? This is a mimic. Yo, Oliver? From Niji Sanji, EN? Niji Sanji JP, I mean. Hold on. It was weird watching while stream Souls games because I'm used to watching other VTubers play these games. And they're actually good at it. What's he even what's he even collecting? Collector? I hardly know her. <laughs> what the? We have vanquished the chicken one. <laughs> Got the drumstick. We got six weapons. Okay, is it worth using a lockstone on this thing? Resignation ahead. Hurrah for quite something. Oh, you can't even go back down here. It's, it's a weird design decision. <laughs> you know, if this was real life, you would just climb up. You would just, you know? Here? No. Once you go down, you can't. <laughs> Heal screen not worth Okay. Other way around, you're doing well. I'm used to seeing people's gem count in the 20s. Well, it's because I bought... I purchased like 40 of them. <laughs> I spent all my money on life gems. Makes up puddle. I don't need that. Oh, what the heck? That's a strong arrow. What the heck was that? How are these arrows so strong? Should I be using arrows? Should I be arrowing these guys? <laughs> yeah, I don't want to be here. Do not shoot at me. 
Please don't shoot at me. Alright, there's no way this is a mimic. I knew it, what did I say? Got the Black Knight Great Axe. Got a Simpleton Spice again. The Monastery Charm. This way. Hiding place ahead? What does that mean? I hate when they make you do platforming in these games. It's not platforming, but it's like falling off ledges. Sometimes I miss when I do the R1 close up with that greatsword, I try the R2's range. Yes. It's when, it's when I try to use the, the jump attack and then I forget. I press the input incorrectly and then I just do a regular R2. I feel like this is going to drop. This feels like... <laughs> this is not going to... It's not going to go well. What's over here? Nothing. There's nothing over here. Nothing on this side. What's this? Try ranged battle. With who? Do I have to jump? Do I like go in there? <laughs> What's the point of this? Oh, okay, I see. They really want me to jump from here to there? There's no way. They they wouldn't they wouldn't make you do that, right? <laughs> They, there's no way. They wouldn't. There's a safer spot. Do I fall on here? And then just walk around? I don't want to fall like in the lava. <laughs> like, okay. That's kind of dangerous. This guy, I like how he doesn't even see me. Okay. He still doesn't see me. What's up with that? Okay, now. <laughs> now I can go down here. Unless there's something that way. Is there something that way? It's probably going to shoot arrows at me. I should probably kill him. <laughs> Yeah, they're all alone. How are they all alone? Oop. Okay, now the question is, okay, it's probably probably something down here. Go back that way. This way? Over here? Got that turtle again. Man. Down is progress. This is down. What was this? Just pull. Is this a shortcut? Is this a Dark Soul style shortcut? Oh frick! Ah, <laughs> uh, what? <laughs> Whoops! I didn't didn't expect that. I didn't know that. I did not know that could happen. That was a <laughs> that was a trap. I, did, I had no idea. Never seen someone die to the guillotine. I didn't even know it was a guillotine. I just thought it was like a like a shortcut. Whoops. That's cool. It's a giant blade. I thought it was just a thing. <laughs> anyway, 
you don't need to go up the ladder. Which ladder? Oh, that ladder. Did, was that a shortcut though? Did that unlock a shortcut for me? I'm stuck? <laughs> okay, I'm not stuck. Alright, we gotta go through this whole thing again. The turtle guy. Oh, I don't have stamina. I didn't have enough stamina for the second hit. I'm gonna heal. Did it look like a fence? It was, yeah, it was like a low fence. What the heck? Excuse me? <laughs> oh, I'm not dead. I thought I died. Literally one HP left. He's a life gem. It was, uh, it was like a little fence made so that people who play Dark Souls can't jump over it. It's to prevent Dark Souls players. Oh no! <laughs> yeah, there's so many icons because we're a clown. <clears throat> Okay. Oh, great bow. That bow, pretty great. One of the greatest bows of all time. Wait, how did we get there last time? Oh, there was a lever, right? All right, we had to pull this lever. I forgot about that. I remember now. Learn how to walk on the fire. I do not. Is there like a ring, like in the first game? Is there a ring? Also, who's shooting at me? Who saw this guy? <laughs> Can't believe this guy. The pots are full of water. Oh. I guess that makes sense. Conveniently place pots of water. I'm going through here again. It's a life gem. Okay, so now we gotta do this whole thing where we fall down again. Oop. Make sure these guys don't hit you. They're so bad at aiming. They like once they choose where they're gonna aim, they don't they don't adjust their aim at all. Oh, did I do a backstamp? I never do backstabs. Alright, we're doing this again. You guys remember when I was here last time? It was pretty cool. What, Fire Castle doesn't have water pots? Um... Bowser's? Okay, <laughs> make sure you don't fall in this thing. I'm always afraid. I'm so afraid that I'll fall in. That was really close. This guy though, this guy did not succeed. Whoops, <laughs> I missed. <laughs> Yeah, I almost died. I imagine dying there. Okay, is is this like up here? Is that a boss? Down here is the guillotine that I died to. When I <laughs> when I destroyed myself. 
Oh shoot. Oh no. Not a boss. It's backwards? Was that the shortcut? Is that the the <laughs> the fog wall from before? Oh so I didn't even need to go this way, huh? That's okay, that's why someone said you didn't need to, you you didn't need to climb the ladder. I see. Oh, so this is just back just back the other way. Oh yeah, okay. <laughs> I see. I see. There was no way for <laughs> no reason for me to do that. And I have no more flasks. Okay, I should go recover my souls. That's a lot of souls though. How many was that? That was like a... Uh, I think I left like 25k souls back there. Yeah, 20, 24k. Wow, that's four, 40k souls. Maybe I should just go back. I got no more flasks. You know what? I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna... <laughs> I'm gonna go back and level up for now. Because I do not want to lose this many souls. There's the bone. The homeward bone is right there. Close. Close to what? Is there another bonfire? Is there a bonfire coming up? Are you sure? <laughs> Are you sure about this? Like right here? Is it right past this room? Whoa. <laughs> okay, uh, I, I don't think I'm going to survive. Yes, I'll use my life gems. Two rooms from here. But I could die. I could so easily die. We got fire. No, <laughs> I'm going to go back. I gotta, I gotta use my, gotta use my souls. Oh, do I want to? I don't know. If I die, I can just come back here, right? What if I just came back here? Plenty. There's plenty of room. Probably wanted to go that way because there's an item there. Is that an item? That is an item. How? <laughs> I feel like that's kind of dangerous to pick up that item. Oh, there's also spikes on the wall. I don't like the look of this. Do not even try. Okay. Climb up. Oh, there is. Is this the, bon is this the bonfire? Perhaps? Is this it? Is is there something up here? Oh, okay, that's another ladder. Is this is this a bonfire? Could this be a bonfire? Yeah, oh, there it is. Okay. <laughs> yeah, imagine if I'd gone all the way back. That would have sucked. Okay, now, now, okay, now I should hydrate again. It's been another hour. Okay. Talk to talk to this lady. Seek seek west. You can get a uh, strength. Get strength up to. What does it? How many do you need to use the? Uh, 
I want Dark Souls. Dark Souls 2, Great Sword. How much strength? We need 1.5 times this many. Okay, it needs 28 strength. So 28 times 1.5. 42. Okay, we need 42 strength to power stance it. Seventy. What? Okay. Let's uh back. Eggles idol. Is that Bowser? Are we gonna fight Bowser? Seventy for the hammer. Okay. <clears throat> Probably not gonna use that. I'm gonna use this. I'm gonna be using this sword forever. What did that do? Does that turn off the fires? Yes? Okay, <laughs> I think it did. Looks like it did turn off the fires. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Now we can traverse safely. It's so quiet. So it's so quiet. Lightning short bow. Oh, I forgot. I forgot that they did this. Oops. <coughs> Okay, oh, we go down this way. Whoa, we got the fire. What the heck happened here? How did they- you, you're telling me they, they built this castle? Like here it's quite a dangerous place. how do you think they built this right <laughs> did they uh the volcano erupt look up behind you before you go in the fog wall why look up at that <laughs> at that thing what the heck is that All right, boss time. <clears throat> Bonfire was in the statue's head. Oh, I see. Is that a dragon? That's a boss. Is that a minotaur? Minotaur? A bull? Oh, is that a Red Bull reference? It's so red. It's Diablo. It's Bowser. Old Iron King. What the? How is this guy so old? <laughs> this guy is so old. And he's iron? And he's in the lava. Oh, I see. I, I understand why he's Bowser now. <laughs> this definitely is Bowser. For real, for real. Welcome, Sleepy. Oh, no. You do be swinging though. Ow! Okay, that's a lot of damage. I was doing so well. I was like two hits away from killing him. Almost first try. Oh wait, there's a whole area there. You could just dodge. You could just walk over there to dodge the attacks. I could have just gone that way. 
That doesn't seem so bad though. <clears throat> it helps that all of our attacks they do like most like a lot of damage to his HP. Go down, go down this way. No, not that way. <laughs> not this way. Over here. Okay, you cannot just run past this guy. You might notice this boss is extremely difficult. That's, that's why he gives you the most souls out of any farmable boss. Let's see. Uh, welcome, Yogi King. Also, yeah, the run back to the boss is just like, you gotta kill one guy. Just one enemy. <clears throat> okay, let's do this again. Nice hat, thank you. I spent good money on this hat. 2,000 souls. So you can just run in here. Like, if you want to avoid it, you can just run here. <laughs> oh, shoot. Welcome, Deafens. Oh, uh, <laughs> whoops. Okay, I'm gonna heal. I'm gonna run over here and heal. What can he do? He's not gonna run over here, right? this guy so old he's so old and iron Ow. Uh, over here I'm gonna heal what the you can't do what the heck <laughs> excuse me you can shoot the fire through the building that's not allowed how did... <laughs> who let him do that? Video game physics. He should have just ran across. He should have just gone to the other side. A wall hacker. Okay, this time though... This, this one, this gotta be the run. Third time, third time's the term. Ironclad helm. <clears throat> Actually, that time I didn't die to the boss. I fell into the lava. So really, it, it, it didn't kill me. It was the environment that killed me. I took fall damage. I took environmental damage. Psychic damage. It's a ceaseless discharge, but you can't cheese him. <laughs> uh, uh, whoops. Okay, that was totally my fault. I just walked off. I just walked into the lava for no reason. I've died twice to, <laughs> to environmental damage. Ceaseless discharge is unironically harder if you fight him normally. I remember the first time I fought Ceaseless Discharge, I did fight him normally. It was good times. One of the bosses of all time. Oh, not this guy. <laughs> Don't go this way. It's over here. He just gave up. He just gave up on swinging. Ceaseless discharge is actually the chaos, which is only sun. How did that happen? I was also thinking of Elden Ring. I was recommending some videos of like Margit or Margit holding up his weapon for like five seconds as people <laughs> were like running around him. 
It's got those delayed attacks. <clears throat> okay, this time though, this time I will not fall in the lava. I will simply... Oh, okay, don't go this way. Do not go that way. I would simply not fall in the lava. What the? Oh, that's what killed me um, the last time. He shot that beam through the wall. Can't believe he would do this. Hey man, his wall hacks. Spider lady? True, there is a spider lady. Whoops! <laughs> Whoops, uh, I rolled the wrong way. What the? Orange scene and Smo if they were normal. Hey, yeah, hold on, I'm not reading the messages. Okay, just like, just a few more hits. Like two more cycles, perhaps. <laughs> I keep rolling into that one. This guy keeps rolling into the fire. Oops. This was not the run. It could have been the run, though. So you have Spider Lady, Different Spider Lady, Ceaseless Discharge, Isoliths, Hollow Witch, Left Bed of Chaos, Right Bed of Chaos, Center Bed of Chaos. Yeah, I did get greedy. It was so close though, I was like, you know, I could, I could do like two more hits. And then I couldn't. And then I failed to do the two extra hits. And then I died. Oh, come on. <laughs> How dare you. Center. Center bed of chaos is the Witch of Isolate. <clears throat> true. So true. But the center bed is just like a bug, right? You're telling me that's the... That bug is a thing. Okay. This time, this time, this is the run. This one's gotta be the run. I didn't mean to hit him three times, but I guess that's also valid. I guess I can also hit him three times. Uh, <laughs> okay. That was not, that was not supposed to happen. He trapped me. There was nowhere for me to go without taking damage. Can you, can't, wait, can you roll through it? I guess I've never tried. It would make sense. In the first game, you can roll through, um... What's his name? Calamite Fire. Just like in real life. Actually, non-ironically, you can roll through fire in real life. Alright. This time, this, this is the run, though. <clears throat> This is the run. And that time I also died by falling into the lava. More than 50% of my deaths are uh, falling into the lava. As a kid I thought I would be on fire more often. Yeah, I've never had to stop, drop, and roll. It's never been relevant. Hopefully it'll never be relevant, you know? It's one of those things you hope you never have to do. <laughs> I keep doing this. 
I keep rolling into that fire. Whoops. Oh no, he tricked me. He did- I thought he was gonna do one hit. <clears throat> he did two. He did the two hit. Stop, drop, and roll right now. Oh, but I'm playing a video game. I am gaming. Okay, you probably could roll through that. You probably should not. <laughs> okay, no, that's fine. I, okay, I keep rolling the wrong way. This keeps happening to me. <clears throat> I misinterpret his attacks. Taking, uh, taking a lot of damage. Probably shouldn't have done that. I'm gonna go back here. He's probably gonna shoot his laser at me. I've already used up all of my healing. I also got greedy there. <laughs> And that was not the run. That was definitely not the run. This is uh taking longer than I thought. I was so close the first time. <laughs> yeah, this next one though, this one's gotta be it. There's no way this one's not it. This one's gotta be. This has to be. There's no way. This one. Got that turtle. This turtle cannot stop me. But he did. Turns out he could stop me. Oh no, oh no. What if I, what if I died to this guy? What did I tell him? <laughs> and he, was, he had one HP left. This one didn't count though. This one I didn't I didn't get to the boss. This doesn't count as a run. This is just a uh just a practice. Did on purpose. No, I I didn't know he would he would have like one HP left. That never happens. It would it would never happen. It's my souls though. My zero souls. Ow. <laughs> See, he's always left with one HP. Why is that? It's kind of suspicious. Almost as if the game is conspiring against me. Okay, this one though? This one? Gotta be the run. See, I'm running right now. I'm literally running. As we speak. It's right here. Ah! Uh, <laughs> okay, so that attack is the fire laser. Sometimes when I when he does that, I think he's gonna do like the fire slam on the ground like that one, but with fire. Sometimes it's not. I'm gonna use a life gem. I think as long as he doesn't use that laser attack, being behind this wall is safe. Um not recommend that though. Should not have done the third hit there, perhaps. Just do two hits. Two hits, that's fine. No need to get greedy. Waste all your stamina on the three hits. This one though, this is fine. It's fine to do three hits on that one. Okay, this could. I think this could be the one. 
If if I didn't roll into that lava, that fire. <laughs> okay, I don't know what that attack. What is that attack? He has not used that attack before. Where is that? Oh, this is one of the. Okay, this is one of the four great souls. I see. I understand. That's a lot of souls. Uh, there's that. That's yeah, the great souls. Wait, what is this? Wouldn't it be funny if this was a mimic? If they said, you beat the boss, congrats. I think it's a thing, and it's actually, it kills you immediately. Uh, there's a lot of blood standing. <laughs> Be wary. Do I want to go? Should I go back? Is there? I I got like a lot of souls. I don't know if I want to. No, I don't. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna go back. There's nothing. How how are there so many deaths over there? How are there that many bloodstains? I'm afraid. I got so many souls. I actually wonder. Maybe they trolled me. They did this to troll me. And they're like, yeah, you just beat a boss. There's a DLC entrance? I see. Well. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go back to town anyway. <laughs> you know? Don't want to risk it. So much death over there. There's a bonfire. I'm sure you're correct, but I would like to play it safe. There is, I know, because usually after a boss, there is usually a bonfire. And there definitely is, but like... The blood stains there? Like, what if something happens? What if I get invaded? Could be an invader right now. Invader Zim is going to show up. Alright. We got 42 strength. And then we got 15 dex. And then vitality. That's good. Now we go back there and then we find out it was just a bonfire. But that's perfectly fine. We were safe. We have uh we played it smart. Did not contribute to the bloodstains. And then I'm sure after that there's nothing else. That's the end of it because that was one of the great, great, uh, one of the four somethings that you needed to kill. One of the four main bosses. It's right there. We Got this guy. You guys remember this guy? Demer souls just used an aesthetic here, it will only affect the boss and the turtle guy. Yes. So true. The turtle guy's gotta be strong. Not their most exciting or interesting boss. No, but what about the part where he shot the, the laser through the wall? That was pretty cool. What about the time when he... See, okay, now all the blood scenes are gone. What happened? Am I not online? <laughs> what happened to the messages? Okay, there's the bonfire. So true. Primal bonfire. It's lit. It's lit, fam. Wait, hold on. I don't want to return... Wait, what was over there? <laughs> I thought I was just sitting down. Okay, I guess that's something. Is there something else over there? Oh, that's the DLC. Okay, whatever. He didn't appear. Who didn't appear? What? Re 
repair. Welcome, Denji. Do I have enough to- no, I don't. I have no Titanite chunks. He's got who? Who's he? He? Him? Me? Do I have enough to level up again? I do. <laughs> Killing that one enemy was enough to level up. I guess I'll do Vitality. How much Vitality do I even need? I'll get it to 15, I guess. And then everything goes into string. Of course, yes, it is is me the clown, the clown with the great sword. Well, I mean, this is like a good place to end the stream, right? Cuz <laughs> we just completed a major objective. Um but, uh, I guess Yes, is it? Wait, wait, can we do some PvP? Can we go to the Belfry whatever? The Belfry Soul. I've never done PvP, like, ever. So you have to equip the ring, right? You equip the... The ring. Bellkeeper's Covenant ring. Then what? <laughs> you equip it and just wait. Does anyone even play in this game? <laughs> what if no one's playing this game anymore? Even if you're not- oh, I see. So you don't have to be here, you can just equip it whenever. Okay. That's pretty cool. I see the oh, you have to equip the ring to see the red guy, perhaps? That's the guy you were talking about? He's random. Yeah, there was supposed to be a guy like over here. No, not here. Like over there somewhere. Oh, there he is. Is that him? That's him, right? This is that guy? This is who you're talking about? That's him. Nothing. I got nothing. Oh yeah, red guy. <laughs> the devil guy. Cow and chicken. I remember. Yeah, red guy destroyed. We got the bell. What's even the point of ringing the bell? What does that do? I don't even know. We just keep going back, we farm that guy. <laughs> I got like 10 minutes to kill. I got like 5 minutes. I can play this for another 5 minutes. It makes the NPC attack. Oh, okay. Oh, so if I was invading. Okay, so if, if there were. Okay, I understand. I think I get it. Might be wrong. I don't know. <laughs> I have no reason to doubt it. I don't, oh, what? There's another guy. There's two guys here. I 
Wow, oh frick, that's a lot of damage. <laughs> it's a lot of, uh, it's a lot of attack you got there. Oops. I attacked the wrong way. Whoa, I almost rolled back into the fire. Firebomb that he threw. Almost. Oh, there is. Oh, we got we got a spirit. Georgesio. Is someone invading me? Where is he? I tried to ring the bell, huh? If he's invading me, like if that if that bell. But I killed all the enemies. <laughs> okay, where is the ghost? Where is he at? Where are you at? I've been invaded. I don't know where he is. Where is he? Is he up here? Yeah, Olua, thank you for the raid. I was about to end my stream. <laughs> uh, hopefully you had a good stream. We're playing some Dark Souls. Is this a real player? Yeah, it's got it has to be a real player. Welcome. I would shout you out, but I'm fighting a person right now. Okay, that was got two raids. Oh, uh, you, you guys are probably doing a collab, huh? Congrats on the collab. We'll do a shout out for both of you. Shout out Lua, be lucky. Three, what the frick, three raids? You were doing art? Were you rigging something? So thank you, Admiral Kobayashi, for the raid. Oh, I guess I'm doing a... <laughs> what the heck is this? Oh, now I'm invading. We're just doing doing some, some Dark Souls PvP. Where am I? Oh, I see. Someone else is actually playing this game at the same time. <laughs> hey, he's also dressed as a jester. I'm, I'm, uh... I'm not fighting this guy honorably. You know, I typically, you know, when you do Dark Souls PvP, I guess you're supposed to, uh... not attack them with, like, the NPCs. <laughs> But I'm just I'm I'm doing BM right now, cause I, I gotta end my stream, you know. Oh, he's gonna ring the bell. He's gonna attack me. He had the eye frames. <laughs> wait, that okay? Wait, the NPCs are not allowed me. They're not attacking me. Yeah, how did that miss? We got the eye frame. <laughs> oh, we're uh, we're up here. We got. Got a ladder going on. Where is he? Where'd he go? No, they've left the area. <laughs> they left. Oh man. Alright, well hope you hopefully you guys had a good collab. Um were you all doing art? Was everyone in the raid? Hold on, let me shout out Skeleton. Underscore ch, I I I spelled your name wrong. Skeleton, Skeleton, Skeleton. Game development. Let's go. And then we had Admiral Kobayashi. You were doing uh, Shadowver. Oh, that's a card game. I know that game. I've never played it. But I am aware that it is it is a game. Okay, we got a different guy now. Where's this guy? Is that him? That's him. That's a guy. Got warned about maintenance of Shadowverse. Got hit with the maintenance. Yeah, we had a uh, steam maintenance when I was playing a uh, Hitman.
Oops. Okay, if you're gonna sip, I'm gonna... I can't sip! Hold on, I can't drink while I'm... <laughs> you're telling me this guy can sip, but I can't. I guess because I am, like, invading him, right? It's Kale. <laughs> I can't sip. I can't sip while fighting. I said Kobayashi enjoyed three more minutes of Shadowverse. Let's go, Shadowverse. I'm about to die. <laughs> what the? That was cool. That was a pretty cool hit. I think if I was allowed to heal, that would have been cool. But I could not. No one does jump attacks in PvP. Not me though. I'm I'm built different. Simply built different. Alright, well this is gonna be the last one. This is the final one. Either that or the next three minutes. If I if I don't get an invasion in three minutes, I'll just end the stream. But it's pretty fun, pretty cool. Dark Souls PvP. First time doing it uh, in Dark Souls 2. I heard Dark Souls 2 PvP is actually pretty good. From what I've heard. Bloodborne. I've never played but <laughs> never played Bloodborne. And I probably never will if they do not port it to PC. Just gonna wait. I'm surprised there were like several people playing this game, like in this area though. I thought this game was dead. I guess the games are not dead. These games are definitely not dead. No, I think I'll call it here. Um, make sure to unequip this. We'll end the stream. Anyway, thanks for the, thanks raiders for raiding like right at the end of my stream. Uh, Belfry and the Keep especially were always big PvP spots. Yeah, there was also this one area that I I guess I missed. It was the the Luna version of this, the Luna Soul or whatever. Sorry, the Luna Luna Belfry. Bell bro. <laughs> okay. Um, would have been cool if I had killed someone there. I could get some uh, some Titanite chunks. But anyway, we're gonna find out what day today is. We're gonna do a raid. Let's see who is available to be raided. There's a boss there. <laughs> there's a boss. All oh, right. There's the the gargoyles. Okay. Let's see. We got Doctor's Day, Land Day. National I am in control day. National folding laundry day. National Wenty day. <laughs> World bipolar day. Pencils have days, do they? There are many days today. Oh yeah, National Pencil Day. Guess we could do that. National Folding Laundry Day? We could do that one. Let's do National Folding Laundry Day Raid. And we'll find someone to raid. Let's see. Twitch.tv. I'm gonna check who I'm following, who I can raid. Many people are streaming. Um, let's see. Who will I raid? Okay, let's uh, let's raid. Let's raid. Let's raid Pete. We're doing that, just chatting. Hold on, hold on. Is he? Is he ending his stream? He's not ending his stream, right? No, he just started his stream. Okay, let's read.
Alright, uh, thanks for watching. Tomorrow I'll be back with the first edition of uh, Miku Picross. We finished playing um, Kimono Friends Picross last Friday. And we're going to start a new Picross tomorrow. And then Saturday I'm going to be playing Mahjong Soul. It's also uh, April Fool's Day, but I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> All the friends are gone. Where have they gone? They're still in the game. Anyway, Miku Picross should be fun. Something something new for once. You know, we've been playing Picross for uh, several months now. You know, we will continue. We will continue to play more Picross. It's like once I finish Mario Picross, I'm gonna like get another Picross game. I'll probably buy like Picross on some other Picross game on the Switch. And then when I beat Miku Picross, I'm gonna buy another Picross game. It'll never end. There's infinite Picross content ahead. Enough content for years. We will never run out. There's gonna be so much stuff. Anyway, um, Ray's gonna go. Thanks for watching. Have a good rest of your Thursday. Goodbye. Picross 3DS. I can't stream from 3DS. Anyway, see you guys.